New at 10, the Morgan County Water and Sewer Authority wants you to know you have options if you can't pay your bill. The utility's website says if you're 10 days late paying a bill, there's a $50 late fee, and you could be disconnected if it's not paid. One customer said she thinks that's unfair during a pandemic. Way 31's Casey Albritton learned how the company's responding. The manager of the Morgan County Water and Sewer Authority, Wayne Reed, says this policy is flexible. He says if you're struggling to make ends meet, you should reach out before your next bill is due and they'll work out a payment plan. Some customers are still saying, though, that this policy is a little too harsh. During a pandemic like this, I think it's probably, we need to have a little grace on some people. We're still not all into jobs working. We're just now getting back into the swing at school. And so I think there needs to be a little bit of grace. Customer Christy Day says she thinks the $50 late fee is too much to charge people who may be unemployed right now. These are tough times. We're still, we're still dealing with lots of issues that even essential workers are having to work and go and make sure that their bills are paid. She also says getting your water cut off for not being able to make payments during the pandemic is extreme. You have to make your bill payments and then you have to make sure that you do what's right and everything else. But, you know, there's some people that just can't help it. Oregon County Water and Sewer Authority Manager Wayne Reed says the policy has been in place for a year, but it was suspended in April and May. In June, it went back into effect. Stimulus checks were being handed out. Unemployment had been increased and we felt like the funds were there. He says the policy is meant to keep people from owing hundreds of dollars in utility bills. You don't want to let people get so far behind that they can't catch up. Reed says he understands people are in a tough position right now. As long as the customer's calling and they're keeping us informed, I'm still unemployed. You know, we're here to help and we will. I think that's a good idea that they continue to let people reach out to them if they have issues. Reed says payment plans will be based on a customer's individual situation. Reporting in Morgan County, Casey Albright and Way 31 News. Now, if your account is closed because of non-payment, the company says you will have to sign up like a new customer to resume service, and that will include paying the setup fee.